What's up, everybody? It's Lil D20 here. And today we are going to be making our Kansas City Chiefs and Philadelphia Eagles Super Bowl 2023 predictions. But before we get into that, make sure to drop a like on this video and subscribe if you're new. And put, don't forget to turn on post notifications so you never miss a video. And we're probably just going to be posting gaming videos and we're finally back. So, um, so yeah, let's just get into this. All right, so my Super Bowl predictions for the Chiefs and uh, Eagles um, in the Super Bowl, I think I think the Eagles have a slight advantage because uh, Jalen Hurts has been playing outstanding this year, like MVP level, and uh, I mean, and the Eagles have a lot of like additions. Uh, they've added like they got AJ Brown this last off season, and they have uh, uh, and they added some people on defense. Uh, they got Darius Slay, and they got some other people. But um, yeah, I mean they've added a lot of good players, and then and uh, I think they really progressed from last year to this year, and it obviously shows. I mean they started off eight and zero, and then they lost to the um, Commanders. I don't really know how it was. That was a pretty winnable game, but I guess they just didn't come in ready, and sometimes that happens. And their defense didn't play as sharp as they usually do. But I mean the Eagles have a really good defense, so I think that's really what'll win them the game. So, I mean my I mean the main reason I think the Eagles have a slight advantage over the Chiefs is because. I mean, their defense is just really good. And as you know, as they say, defense wins championships. So I really think the Eagles might uh, pull this one out. But I mean, the Chiefs are really good too. I mean, Mahomes and Kelsey just on offense just puts it down right there. So I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, it could get out of hand with both teams. But I think it's going to be a really close and good game. But I think, uh, and also McCall Hardman, he's basically like a carbon copy of, um, a copy of, um, Tyree Kill. He's pretty he's fast. A little bit worse. Yeah, I mean, he, he's a little slower, but I mean, still, he's really fast and really electric. So, I mean, if they can get him involved, that'll be a really big, helpful piece right there for the Chiefs. But for me, really, I think the Eagles might pull this one out. I mean, they have a good offense. I mean, Hurts has been playing, like, uh, MVP level. And uh, they have Dal Dallas Grover, A.J. Brown, Devontae Smith, and just a lot of good pieces to their offense miles sanders as a running back so yeah i think the eagles are going to pull this one out um my score predictions for the game i think uh, uh i mean i'm going to say because I, I think it's a close game so i'm gonna say like both uh predictions like both prediction scores for both teams if they do win so i think um i think if the chiefs win it's going to be like 30 to 20 30 to 20 um 30 24 um, I, uh, actually, no, 31 24, I think, is going to be the score for the Chiefs uh, if they win. But for the Eagles, which I think you are going to win, I think that will lose a slight advantage over the Chiefs. I think they're going to win if they do. Uh, uh, I think it's going to be a close one and a high scoring game. But I think it's going to be uh, the score, a final score is going to be 33 to 27. Uh, no, 33 28, sorry. I think the, um, the Eagles defense is going to uh, shut down Mahomes in the fourth quarter and uh, Hurts is going to just run away with it on like uh on the game winning touchdown or game winning field goal so uh yeah i mean those are my predictions for the super bowl and now we're going to turn it over to my brother and yeah let's see what his predictions are so my predictions are i uh the kansas we're gonna start off with the kansas city chiefs so the kansas city chiefs they still have patrick mahomes young healthy amazing superstar and he's very good at the game He's won a Super Bowl, so he's already probably accomplished every quarterback's goal. And he has made the AFC Championship a bunch. Yeah, so I, I think, didn't they have like a streak? A streak? I think it's five years in a row or something like that. Yeah, and I and I just, I, my opinion is um, the Chiefs have an amazing team. What, but they just recently lost Tyree Kill at the like start of the season, and that's I don't know how that happened. I feel like that still would have been a great com um what is it called like uh, oh yeah a great combo yeah great uh duo and stuff and I feel like that and but Travis Kelsey and Patrick Mahomes are still a great duo and um I feel like the the Patrick Mahomes, he's very good, but I feel like the Eagles, I feel like the Eagles have a pretty better team. They have a great offense, pretty good defense. They have Jalen Hurts, an M MVP candidate, and A.J. Brown, he's amazing. Like, can't go wrong with him. It's like a truck, like wide receiver 
Derrick Henry 2.0. But anyways, I feel like the Eagles are going to come out with a dub. Because I just feel like they're... They just have a slight advantage on offense and defense. So, just a tiny bit, though. But I feel like it's also funny, like, just something extra. I just feel like it's really funny that uh, two brothers are in the same Super Bowl. Oh, the yeah. Super Bowl. Yeah, Jason Kelsey and Travis Kelsey. But, um, all right, so what are your score predictions for the Super Bowl? My score predictions, um, I'm going to just say for both teams, but I really feel like the Eagles are going to win. I feel like I want the Eagles to win because Patrick Mahomes already won one. So, but my score predictions are going to be the Eagles are going to, if they win, which I think they will, I mean, they should, but if they just fall down for some reason, I think the Eagles are going to win, like, I feel like it's going to be a high-scoring game, so I have a feeling it's going to be probably, like, 30. to 31 35-31 and I have a feeling if the Chiefs win that the score predictions are going to be 24-27 to 34 alright alright guys well that's our predictions for the Super Bowl and now we're going to turn over to like what we're going to be posting um uh you know like later and uh like um because we're not posted in a while so yeah we're going to be saying like what we're going to be posting uh, for the next few days, or maybe for when we post again, um, so basically, we're gonna be doing a lot of, like, um, gaming videos, and, uh, sports videos, and we're gonna be posting, like, a bunch of great videos, like, maybe some challenges, spicy food challenges, yeah, and just fun videos, and try to make it daily for you guys, and, um, if you guys wanna go, if you guys have any computers or laptops, you can go into the discussion of my channel, and you can, Say what you want to say, or like say maybe some YouTube ideas, YouTube video ideas, or just try to you know say what you say whatever you want to say. Just keep it positive, cause you know we don't want to hurt anybody's feelings, cause we want to stay positive around here. So, but um, yeah, I mean, and uh, usually the comments are open, but sometimes they're closed. But uh, yeah, um, if you guys want to comment down below, you guys can uh, any video ideas or anything you guys want to say, all that. But um. Yeah, I mean, we're basically going to be posting a lot of sports videos like this, like for off-season stuff, because the Ravens, obviously, you guys know I'm a Ravens fan. Uh, they, they they just uh, ended their season in a tragic uh, loss to the Bengals. Um, it was a really bad loss. Yeah, but... if it wasn't for, like, Tyler Huntley doing that big sell or James Prochet, I mean, it's not really his fault, but he could have caught that. But if Tyler Huntley had just made that touchdown, then I think we would have won. Yeah, it was definitely the one of it was definitely the sneak that really cost us games. Is if 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 he wanted to ran it in, to me that's to me that's almost any play there besides that play, and we put and we would have won that game. But it is what it is. I mean Huntley was. I mean he. I mean he barely. He's he's never played a, play, a playoff game. He only played that one time against the Bills back in twenty twenty in the divisional round. So I mean he's not had much experience in that, but it was a close game and it was a fun game to watch, but. I mean, honestly, uh, uh, so basically we're going to be posting more, obviously, more gaming videos, sports videos. Uh, I'm going to be start posting more Orioles videos because they're about to start in, like, a month. And their spring training starts in, like, I think two weeks. So, yeah, uh, I'm going to start coming up on that again, like, updates for them and um, score reviews and all that and um, all that. So, yeah, um, uh, hopefully I can try to get my brother a a Avery to start posting on his little A's corner. Uh, if you guys want to go watch that, you can go check that out uh, after you're done watching this. But, um, all right, well, or I guess, oh, yeah, well, what else? You guys can comment down below what you, uh, or if the comments are open, or if the if you have a computer or laptop or something, you could go on the discussion and comment what you want, like, or gaming videos or anything, like what type of videos y'all want us to be posting. And it. If we post it, depending on how much likes it gets, we can do it again. Yeah, if we can get maybe like ten likes or five likes on this video, we'll do a video on like um like my gaming, like maybe like two K or whatever you guys want to do. Um, Madden, Madden, Fortnite, yeah, anything. So uh, whatever you guys want to do, just uh, comment down below in the comments. 
and yeah i mean that's all we have for today if you guys like this video like the video and subscribe and don't, don't um make sure to turn on post notifications so you never miss a video and just make sure to spread as much positivity as you can in the world and help everybody you can and just don't try to be negative on others because you don't know what they're going through so uh yeah i mean that's pretty much all we have for today we hope you guys enjoyed and we hope you guys um and we'll and we'll be back with another one and we'll see you guys later peace